Good morning everyone. Today I thought that I would do a day in my life video because I have never done one on my channel and thought that you guys might just want to see um, what I do. So yeah, I'm gonna just start my day. I'm pretty tired. So a lot of you guys are probably wondering what I use in the morning, so I just go in with the toner. I use this toner. I recently just started using it, as you guys can tell. It's pretty moisturizing, and yeah, it gets the job done. I feel like um, more than night, I like to put it on in the morning because I feel like it just does better for my skin. Next up, I go in with Hanyu. This is going to be the Red Rise Essential Skin Softener. Last but not least, it is going to be my favorite, the Trilogy Vital Moisturizing Cream. Looks like this. So one thing I really like about the 100 is that it just makes my skin glow, which I personally like. And this is just like my holy grail. I don't know, I just always end up coming back to the Trilogy. I just put it on like this little spatula and then Rub it all over my face. So for 2020, there are five New Year's resolutions that I made to myself or five lifestyle habits that I'm trying to incorporate in my daily routine. Um, because honestly, 2019 was a wreck, just physically, emotionally, and just a toll on my body. So the first thing is I have been waking up earlier and that just feels so great. I used to sleep at 5 and I used to wake up at 1 or 2 and I would skip breakfast as a whole. So I realized that it was really causing a toll on my body and I was constantly tired. Even though I slept the 8 hours, I would always feel tired. So that is something that I have been changing in my routine. I wake up at 9 and I eat breakfast. Number 2 is to eat breakfast. And I've been eating breakfast. I was never really a breakfast person and um, to be honest, that's probably one of the hardest things changing into just my daily routine But I have been loving it because I feel like eating breakfast really does give me the energy that I need throughout the day And it's just been really good. So number three is I have been eating less flour um, For those of you guys who might not know, I don't think you guys know I get a lot of indigestion so I think that Normally, like in 2019, I would get indigestion at least once a week, at least. And it really was a toll on my body because I really couldn't do anything. Once I get an indigestion, I get a bad headache and it was just so bad for me. So I've actually been cutting out on flour because for me, flour was really hard to digest. I love bread, I love pasta, I love pizza, and I don't know, I think that's probably the hardest thing, but um, something that I've been really trying to eat less of. I haven't cut it fully out of my diet, but that is one thing that I have been really trying to um, avoid as much as I can, but it's just super hard because those are like the things that I love. Flowers and literally everything, but that's one of them. And then another thing is that I have been trying to cut back on coffee. Originally, I drank two to three cups of coffee a day and it was just really addicting in a way. I feel like I depended on coffee, I depended on the caffeine, and um, it was to a point where even if I drank two to three cups of coffee a day, I would still be tired, and also that was another thing that kept me up late and why I slept late. So for me, I actually have been replacing coffee with a tea um, that I drink in the morning, and then um, last but not least is I've actually been taking a lot of probiotics and things that are cleansing my body so that um, I could digest faster and just live a healthier lifestyle because I think for 2020, um, my main goal is to live a healthier lifestyle because 2019 I had a very hard time, but 
Um, in the morning, I like to start off with tea. And um, this is basically a 28 day tea talk. So a tea tox is basically gonna help you remove all the toxins in your body. It is going to increase your metabolism, also improve with indigestions or just your digestion, which I have been really, 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 really loving. There is going to be a morning tea and a night tea. So the morning tea is called the morning boost and it really does give you that boost in the morning. So I have been replacing my coffee with this tea in the morning and I realized that it really kind of kickstarts my day and this tea, it tastes so good. I'm not even kidding. So basically, this tea has like a subtle fruity note and most of the time, if the tea is too fruity and overwhelming and overpowering, I don't like to drink the tea because it's just so much flavor. But I feel like this is just perfect. It's very subtle and I love to drink it and I feel like it's been really helping with my digestion as well. It's been around, I would say, two weeks since I have tried this and I haven't gotten an indigestion since, which is great because that is something that I literally suffer from. And another thing is the night tea. So basically the night tea, um, I drink it every other day and it's been really helping me go to the restroom, you know, and doing my thing in the restroom. But at the same time, I feel like it's a perfect tea to kind of just wind down your night. And I just been really loving these two teas and I have incorporated it into my daily routine of just what I have been consuming. And I think that it is just a step in changing my lifestyle for a healthier lifestyle because yeah, 2020, that's my goal. So yeah, let's go make breakfast. So this is how it is, and then I'm just gonna close it up and then begin to omelet. The omelet is done. This is how it looks like. I know, look, woo! After I started making breakfast, I think that I am gonna be Chef Subini soon because I'm super confident in making an omelet. I have been making other things too, but I feel like the most convenient thing for me is eating omelets, so yeah. Come at me. I love sriracha and I eat my omelets with sriracha. I don't eat it with ketchup, but I only put it on half because uh, I don't like to start off my morning with something too spicy, so I just put on half the omelets, it's like I enjoy half and then the other half it's more just kind of a regular omelet but yes, sriracha is my face Ooh, did you see that cheese? Mm. Clear So I just finished editing a little bit and now I'm gonna eat lunch. So this is how it looks like. This is a fried egg, um, also hummi rice, like brown rice, and then avocados, some lettuce, and then that is the sauce that you put in. Yeah. I like saying clear after I finish eating something. I don't know why, but in my head, it's like I cleared it, so I just say clear, but yeah. So this is the place I order the food from. It's called Paddy Superfood, and I always order the same thing. I always order the avocado, wasabi bowl, and then I get an acai bowl like this. When I was a kid and I didn't eat my food, my mom would always do this airplane trick. She would basically get a spoon and then she'll be like, say ah, 
An airplane's coming. Woo! So I just went to CJ yesterday and I kind of want to show you guys the products that I got real quick. So um, this is going to be the Peach C eyeshadow palette like this. I have used this before. I personally really liked it so I purchased another one. And then also this is a new palette from Mood Eyes and um, it's actually a eyeshadow palette or like a color that I've never really used before. So that is the reason why I got it. It's very soft and it's called Cashmere eyeshadow palette. I personally really, really, really love this, so I picked it up again. This is the Hanyu Red Rice Essential Skin Softener. This is really good. I actually purchased like three of these because I wanted my mom to use it as well. And then, like you guys know, as always, I picked up the Kiss Me products because I love Kiss Me. For those of you guys who are wondering what color it is, it is actually brown. I use brown eyeliner and brown mascara. Yes. And actually, these two products are for my mom. My mom picked these out. Um, this is basically an IOPE cushion pack. And you know, it just looks like this. Um, it looks like something my mom would use, right? <laughs> mm. And also, my mom really, really loves glitter. And ever since she was young, she used this glitter liner. And as soon as she saw this, she's like, Oh, now you go buy this. She's like, I need to buy it. This as well, um, I actually picked this up for my older brother because he said that he really liked this. I guess it's very lightweight and my brother really likes lightweight things so that is something I picked up as well. And like always, just Kosar X acne patches. And I actually purchased two lipsticks. Wow, look at this. Look at this. This is from Dear Dalia and um, the colors are different. They're very similar but um, if you see, it's perfect for just spring and it is also going to be a little bit sheer and glossy which I am technically kind of going more for these days because I haven't been really using too many matte products. This is another color right here. Yes. Also, um, this is just like a eyebrow mascara that I also picked up too. It's just a very simple eyebrow mascara. And yeah, that's what I picked up. So now I'm gonna go out and get my hair done because I'm gonna be doing a certain video so I need to change my hair color. Um, I will let you guys know a little bit later what I might do. And then this is basically, oh, okay. This is basically just my outfit for today. Wearing red and then I pack the tea and my camera in here and we're ready to go. Let's go. So I am at the hair salon, came here, I think that it's gonna rain and I wore the wrong shoes but basically I'm waiting to get my hair done. So the reason why I am here to get the hair salon is because I might possibly film another transformation video and I have to dye my hair because um, my hair right now it's like all different colors so that's why I'm here and hopefully Captain can make a miracle happen to the hair or the hair color. So Captain's trying to brush my hair because it's so tangled, but she buy more yakan kuron likimania. So I'm actually gonna go for like um, color that's very similar to black, a very dark color. I'm excited. Oh, 손이 보라예요? 네. 대박. 이거 퍼플 샴푸라고 염색기 잡아주는 거. 순간 잘못 본줄 알았어요. <웃음> 아, ASMR 같은. <웃음> Done with my hair. Thank you. So I just got my hair done, and now I'm gonna be waiting for a bus to go to Shinsa to meet a friend for dinner. So yeah. So 
So I just came to the Lens store and for those of you guys who don't know, I'm at Da Vinci where Mama Moo is the model and I actually had to pick up some clear lenses and also color lenses so that is the reason why I'm here. So I picked up my lenses, that is my eyes. I have really bad eyes guys. Oh wow. That's cool. So after buying my lenses, I came to eat in Shinta. And this is actually a really, really, really famous sushi place where a lot of celebrities came. As you guys can see, it's endless. And yeah. Honestly, I would want to read you guys, everybody who came here, but there's just so much. So I'll link it below where it is, and you guys can come for yourself and see who came here. My sushi came out. I ordered the tsukson, which is basically what you're seeing right now, and then it comes with udon. Mm -hmm. This is my favorite place in Harajuku. It's literally the bomb. I eat it with a spoon because the rice falls apart easily, but honestly, it's so good. So one thing that I really love about this place is that ever since I came here the first time, this hajangnim, he was so nice and also it's really good service here and I feel like everybody who works here is really nice as well so I feel like it's always a good place to come back because I always get good energy from here so that is the reason why I really recommend this place. Oh, I don't have a smiley face today. No. Oh, I have a heart. She gave no, me a heart. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my own. <laughs> <laughs> How do you say kyung got mixed nuts. nuts? Oh yeah, I know. Cause... Nuts. Hey, I had a brain fart. Passion driven idols. PDA. Horror. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's as bad as that. That's so bad. Oh my god. Wait, that, that's I love it. A, that's a... So I am at radio now. Actually, right now it is 10 21. Mm -hmm. We start radio. Are you like. <laughs> <laughs> what is this I'm like so extra like, coming in right now? I'm pretty sure everyone's gonna. I will show him later to you guys. And I brought the tea here with me for the radio since when I do radio, I want to drink something. I'm gonna be doing it like lukewarm water though because I feel like if it's too hot, I'm not gonna be able to drink it. Oh no, the string fell inside. No! Mm, perfect. Perfect temperature. Hello, my name is Maddox. Maddox? Yeah. What is your Korean name? Ah, uh, Gyeongmun. <laughs> you, 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 you can call you can call me Moon. Moon. If you want. Moon. To you guys. Yeah. Mm, okay, so we do radio together. Yes, um, we do. How's radio? Um. Well, it feels like I'm like trying to learn English. Mm -hmm. It feels like a good time to speak English because like since I don't have any uh, English talking people. Yeah, you guys are gonna see a lot of behind the scenes today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. Did you press it? Yep. Okay, watch. Okay. Maddox camera right now. No. <laughs> <laughs> I just saw you. Oh my god. Alright. <laughs> what? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say, I'm gonna... Don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. <laughs> it's finally happened. Headmaster has sent me to detention. Don't worry, you're not the only one in trouble. Shh, it's time to sit up straight and pay attention at the detention with, with our backseat slacker. Oh my gosh! 
I told you not to do that. I was waiting for her to make eye contact. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> anyways, welcome to another session of detention with your Monsters Inc. trio. Mike Wazowski, Sully, and Boo. Oh wait, hold on. Who's? Oh wait, so you're Mike Wazowski. Maddox no. is Sully and I'm Boo, I guess. Oh, really? Oh. I mean, I don't know. That's the, that's the order. Be. That's the I order. I want to be Boo. You I think be I Boo. should be Mike. You want to be Mike? Okay, yeah. I guess I'll be Sully then. <laughs> what the heck? As soon as I start filming. Hi! This is Benil. Maddox, like you guys saw. And we're doing a song break right now. So, yeah. Everyone's pretty tired today because it is... 10.40 A.M. P.M. <laughs> oh, and we end at 11.30 12 12 for you Y'all wanna stay and wait for me to No! Okay. <laughs> okay! 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 Why are you crying? <laughs> the song is so touchy <laughs> oh. So basically this is the live chat that comes on when Peniel is on live, he is live at 10 p.m. every day at TBS. So. I could see. <laughs> I could see. Is it a vlog? Yeah, it's a vlog. Oh, okay. TBS EFM. Hello. Hello. The time is 7 p.m. <laughs> Or maybe just say what you remember the most then. Well, uh, the first one was You Know You Know Oh yeah, like, that was pretty like, I can't even imagine um, Sleeping like, in Yeah, Station. sleeping in <laughs> 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 Yes! <laughs> I love it! Oh, that's a chumet jo <laughs> oh, is that this one? Yeah. Oh, 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 my God. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah.